For dozens or hundreds of years, the metric system has revolutionized the way everybody who measures things measures things in most countries. But how did the metric system come about? Back in the Dark Ages, the people used to measure things. But how did they do that? Well, it was simple, really. They used to measure body parts of whoever the king would happen to be at the time. And that's how the basic unit of measurement came to be. A foot would be based on the foot of a real king, an inch would be based on the finger of a real king, and a yard would be the distance from the king's nose to the tip of the king's outstretched thumb. This caused problems because kings were never a uniform size. This caused all sorts of misunderstandings with regard to trade, and during the French Revolution, all of a sudden parts of royalty were falling off for some reason. Therefore, they had to work out a different means of measurement. So the best surviving French scientists, like Lavoisier, came together to work out the best way of standard measurement. And when they succeeded, we had the metric system. After which time, Lavoisier's head somehow came off. But it was already too late for the old non-standard standards, because here comes the metric system! What they came up with was a universal standard of measurement, measuring the circumference of the Earth through a line through Paris, and then dividing it up by 10 million, and there you had the meter. After you had your standard meter, you could make metric versions of every single standard unit of measurement. Not only length, but volume and weight too. And with those you can work out temperature, force, torsion, and everything else you could attempt to measure, even time itself, but we won't mention metric time anymore. The metric year, day, hour, and minute didn't quite work out. But today all the other units of the metric system have been adopted nearly everywhere on the planet, except for the USA, Liberia, and Myanmar, formerly Burma, and parts of Britain. But you know, metric is kind of French. But everybody else, even the Germans, have gotten on board and embraced the metric system. So join the 21st century by joining the 18th century by adopting the metric system today.